This is a KGUN 9 on your side news update. Thanks for joining us. I'm Stella Inger. A hit and run on the south side sent a person to the hospital with life threatening injuries. This happened near Cole and 29th Street. Tucson police are asking drivers to avoid the area while the investigation is underway. Get away! This is dramatic video sent to us tonight showing the moments a smoking truck guy hit by a train. It happened in downtown. Tucson police say no one was injured. This was around 8 on Wednesday night. The truck stalled on the train tracks and the driver was able to get out. Stay with KGUN9.com for the very latest developments. And closing arguments underway in the trial of a man accused of killing his stepdaughter last year. In an unusual move, Joshua Lelevere took the stand in his own defense. He's accused of killing 13-year-old Jaden Glome. During the investigation, police found surveillance cameras in Jaden's bathroom, which Lelevere says were to help catch proof that she was drinking alcohol. And let's go ahead and take a look at our weather with Kyler Diggs. Stella, big changes are on the way as we've been advertising over the last few days. A cold front will sweep across the area Thursday night into Friday morning, bring some valley rain and mountain snow with it. And then another surge of moisture will push through here late Saturday into Sunday with more valley rain and mountain snow. Snow levels dropping down to about 4,500 feet by the time we get to Sunday. It clears out for a couple of days, remains chilly, and then here comes another big change by the end of next week. We do have winter weather advisories in effect for the White Mountains extending northwest into the Mogollon Rim. That's from Thursday night into Friday morning. Could see up to about eight inches in those areas. Now take a look at the temperatures dropping into the 60s for highs on Friday and Saturday, 50s for Sunday and Monday. A little rebound into the 60s before that next wave of cold weather comes in. Look at the overnight lows to start the week next week, dropping into the 30s. Tyler, thank you. That does it for us. I'm Stella Inger for KGUN 9 on your side.